I'm Felicity and I work for Water Safety New Zealand. And I am Katie and I'm currently teaching travel and tourism. We felt really proud that we could wear something from our hometown, um, something from you know another RSA further in the South Island and um, something about our country and represent on the day. Well we got to this commemorative site at about 4pm, 5pm the previous night and we set up camp and had dinner and everything picnic and you're under the hills of where the, the Turks would have been hills? firing down from. Cliffs. Cliffs. <laughs> oh, as, we, as we were walking there we walked past this little cove and actually that was the sign that said Anzac Cove on it. I said this, this is it, this is Anzac Cove and we just stood there for a minute because it was tiny, it was, it was just tiny. this narrow strip of sand and then a cliff. The MC would tell you what the guys were doing throughout the night. He'd, be, he'd say now they were put prepping the boats at this stage and now they would be getting into their boats out in the ocean and now they'd be rowing towards the shore. It's a standard dawn service, yeah. so um, it, it follows the same format as, as what you'd get in Wellington or Porirua. Yeah, yeah they have the, the same readings and the, and the same words and things like that. Yeah. Um, it was just that, you know, you had speakers such yeah. as the, the Prime Minister and Prince yeah. Charles. Um, yeah, pretty emotional. Uh, people getting emotional around you, especially national anthems and things like that. You could see people getting really involved, but everyone was just taking it in, you know, everyone yeah. was just listening, intense. I mean, that war, so many people died, so much more than any other war previously. Yeah. On the way to Anzac Cove, you pass the Ataturk Memorial, and um, those words, they make me cry every time. It's all about forgiveness and accepting that your children are now at rest in a peaceful land and everything. Yeah. So yeah. that was really nice, and yeah. definitely travelling around Turkey, you felt like that all the time. Yeah, very accepted. Yeah.